Greetings everyone, my name is Dom and welcome to a little update video. So this video was supposed to be a vlog, but I've just done a load of filming for a new PC build video, and so the camera is dead, the SD card is full, and I'm tired as fuck. So I thought this would be a much better and more chilled out video to do. Also, I've just had a nap, so I'm not really in the mood for much more than chilling with you guys. By the way, please click on whatever section you want to skip to, as this video may be quite long. Time keys for mobile users will be in the description also. At the start of January, we hit 10,000 subscribers. That's one of the most important milestones you can hit with YouTube. Hitting the big 10k is a big slap in the face as it sort of enlightens you to the fact this is no longer just a small time thing to do on the side. This is a real responsibility now, and in 2017, I aim to make YouTube a much bigger priority. My channel is growing and I need to grow with it, so I intend to put much more of my spare time to use much more effectively. But before I get into what's going to change, I need to brief you guys on what's happening and why I haven't really been uploading much. The fault at its very core lies with college and my time management. I have so many responsibilities that I need to uphold and all of them take a lot of time out of my week, which I used to spend making videos. Before my previous YouTube channel, I uploaded one video a day and I'd love to do that again, but it's these responsibilities that keep getting in the way. Let me elaborate on this. I have my subs telling me to upload more, and each video takes a good 10 to 15 hours on average to produce. This one likely won't take as long due to its simple nature, but not all videos can follow the same formula. On top of that, I have college. College consumes literally all of my time, up until about 3am. I have many assignments handed to me at once, with only a couple weeks to complete them. These assignments aren't small either, they're things like making a short film and, by the way, you're on your own lol, or create a fucking magazine articles to go with it. Don't lorem ips on me, cunt. And then to go with each of these projects, I have to write about 2,000 words to evaluate each one. Let me remind you, I have to do four assignments simultaneously, four evaluations, four big fuck off projects, and only two weeks to do them. And they're running around wondering why we're stressed. Take a big fucking hint. I've had to design and make a newspaper. I've had to create my own short film. What about the fictional radio story? Edited it up with sound effects and shit. And that's not even the end of it. It is draining. I'm also going to the gym when I get time because I'm just sick of how I look. I don't want to be chubby anymore. I've been going about three times a week, but this past week has rendered me incapable due to the short film I made. So stress levels have been higher than ever. I have to see my girlfriend and my friends a lot too. Otherwise, I literally start going insane. And sorry for the rant, but as a cherry on top of all this, I have to work my only day off in the week. And that's a 10 hour workday we're talking about. All of these things inhibit me from making videos for you guys. I wish, to my very core, that I could make videos. That's literally the only thing that I want, but until now that just hasn't really been physically possible for me. So I hope that gave you guys a bit of insight on why I haven't been uploading, but it's a bit different now. I've now started my FMP. All of those projects we did previously are finished. They were for building up skills needed for the FMP, your final major project. I'm now working on a proper film, and yes, if you thought that sounds like a lot of work, then you'd be right. But I have three months to complete this project, which is a lot more manageable than two weeks. This means I now have time to make videos again, which is great news for my stress levels as it really helps calm me down when you guys are engaging with the video, it's nice. So what's new with the channel? Well, I'm now dedicated to making multiple videos a week. Some of these videos may be minor, like benchmarks and tutorials again, but I'll still be uploading my main higher level content. In fact, I have a couple videos coming out on this new PC challenge. Basically, I set myself a £400 budget and within this budget I needed to make the most powerful PC possible, and that's exactly what I did. It's getting built tomorrow and will hold many uses. For a little sneak peek on the kind of performance you can get with it, it does 4K gaming. Proper 4K gaming too, and no, I'm not joking. Hopefully you guys are interested in that. I've also upgraded to a GTX 1080 from my 1070. Some of you may be wondering why I would do this after downgrading from a 1080 just a couple months ago. This is simply because of my lovely new ultra-wide monitor. The 1070 isn't really enough for me anymore. I want to take full advantage of the monitor. A video is coming out at some point covering that. This upgrade will benefit you guys more than you realise though. For commentaries, I wanted to use 4K 60fps footage so I can upload in super high quality, no upscaling required. Because I'm building a second PC, I can finally use that 4K 60fps capture card, which will be great. 
So essentially the GTX 1080 will power the 4K 60fps footage and therefore will power the transition of putting all of my footage in 4K. Feels good scrub. I know it's been nearly two months since we hit 10k but I just wanted to say an absolutely massive thank you to you guys. It's you guys who await my videos so patiently and get so engrossed whenever I am able to upload. You guys at your cause are very nice people. The community we're growing here isn't rude, it's not volatile or shit like Leafy's. It's a great community and one that I'm proud to call my own. So, once again, a bloody big thanks to all those who lend their support. This means so much to me, and you guys are literally making my dreams come true. I invest a lot of time and effort into this channel, as well as money, and so I've started up a Patreon for those who wish to donate small amounts of money to help out with the channel. If you donate $5 or more, you are now eligible for a hardware giveaway. This can include peripherals, graphics cards, CPUs, stuff like that. They may not be the newest items, they may not even be new, as they may be used in videos, but if you're starting out or if you like the idea of getting a GPU for $5, then you're in luck. When I get enough patrons for this tier of giveaway, I'll let you guys know what it's going to be via a YouTube video, and then I will go forward with it. Remember, there aren't going to be many who pledge $5 a month, so chances of winning are really high. I have a dedicated video talking about my Patreon soon. But anyway guys, thank you so much for listening intently to my babbling for this long. I had some things I need to get out and now they've been said, I feel a lot better. I'm going to try my best to keep making as many videos per week as possible. I have so many ideas for videos. So as a summary, quality of videos will go up, frequency of videos will go up, I'll no longer be stressed and eventually I'll be skinny. Oh, and you can win a GPU for $5. All while also funding my more ambitious videos like the PC build challenge I'm releasing soon. Thank you guys so much again for 10k, it really means the world, and here's to 10k more. If you like this video then do show your appreciation by tapping that like button. I love your face, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Terra.